Welcome back to Live with ITP Live. If you guys don't know ITP Live, we are the biggest influencer agency in the Middle East. Before we start, please subscribe, follow us on ITP Live Instagram, and leave a comment below with your question. We're here to answer those questions. Buying fake followers. Having fake followers on your account is not a good thing. Even if your following has grown exponentially, in a very short period of time. I have bought them, but for my job, I have to do it for research, you know? She calls it research. Whether it's stalking, it <laughs> whether it's buying fake followers, <sighs> whether it's killing somebody, it's just under the purpose of research. Okay. How do you know that someone's followers are fake? If somebody has a huge following, but not a lot of likes or not a lot of comments, they have something called ghost followers. <laughs> which are kind of fake followers that you just kind of acquire being on the platform, or they could have just actually bought fake followers. The professionals like us, we know it when you've bought fake followers. Okay. Can I talk about it now? So you should be doing everything in your power to get rid of them. And to grow your organic yeah. followers. You should be more concerned with your rates of engagement, which is how people are interacting with your content. Focus on building a community. We have a website called Live Unite. With this website, you can put the name of that influencer. I'm not gonna say if it's a she or a he. This influencer at 12 a.m. gains 2,000 followers daily. Justice? will be after you, and all that followers will be out, and you will be out, irrelevant, boom boom. Hashtag and rant. There are a lot of tools out there that will measure follower growth. I think Social Blade is the most popular one. If you see that somebody's following is kind of going up in like a smooth curve style, and then all of a sudden it spikes right up, that's how you know that somebody potentially may have bought followers. In the beginning, because like I felt like I needed that ego boost at that time and I was trying this new app, I bought around, around 500 followers. Every day I have a drop in followers. Organically, Instagram puts them up. What's the name of that app that cleans out your fake followers in case you feel that it's time for them to leave? So it's a completely free app to download on either the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store, and it's called Cleaner for Instagram. Ain't no brand paid us to say this. We've done our research. Let us know in the comments if yep. you know of a better way of cleaning out fake followers or ghost followers. We will leave a link in the description box if you want to download it. If I had 100,000 followers and then they dropped to 50,000 followers, I would just create a whole drama around that I had to remove them because they were creating a lot of negativity in my life. Maybe it's time for you to reevaluate your life if you have over that many people creating negativity. If you're an influencer and you go into a meeting uh, with a brand or with an agency and you go, hey, this is my following, but three or four years ago, I ended up buying 5,000 fake followers. There's no harm in being transparent about that. Like, subscribe, comment below. That's if you, it. If you wanna know about anything else, we're here for you. There's a red button below. Down there, click it. Thanks, Thanks guys. guys. Be sure to tune in next time.